We were always looking for to develop a, a Caribbean looking house since that was a comment that was given to us last uh, event on 2007. We are one of the few uh, universities who have been competing every single solid decathlon. So we took that and we developed a house that was Caribbean looking, that was affordable because that's something really important considering how the economy is going. Our exterior woods are redwood that's been reclaimed from a remodeled building in the university. They were going to throw away some of the woods that were beams for, of windows. And for the interiors, we also had reclaimed woods in the flooring, which is thick wood from some uh, benches in the parks in San Juan. We're using an innovative product that is new in the market here in America. It's an Italian acoustic system that integrates a radiant ceiling. And we also have another product that are the, the shading device, which are the screens. It's both a poetic element for the Caribbean and plus we use it as a, one of passive elements that will help cool down the house since it reduces around 80% of the radiance. It looks like a really simple house from the outside, but it's actually very detailed in its work and is very edgy. And we have a space in the bedroom, it's actually a space, not a room. It is a Murphy bed that's concealed in this movable wall that uh, makes the space inside in the hallway that connects the whole uh, conditions area bigger or a little bit uh, closer. And it affects the space of the bathroom area. It could be like a half bath or a full bath, depending on the position it has. Where do we take the house after the event is done? And we took care of that by uh, offering the house to some sponsors, the possible sponsors. And it's actually going to be on a public exhibit in one of the cities really close to San Juan, the municipality of Caguas. Uh, they're going to have it in their botanical garden and they're going to be taking care of it.